make sure you take them out at least 20 feet from your house, and you want to make sure that you use an approved propane tank. So you want to make sure you check it, it has, it has a shutoff valve, you want to check the date, and make sure that it's approved by Underwriter Laboratories. And you want to make sure when you put your turkey inside your oil, you don't want your turkey to be frozen. You don't want it to be frozen, and you want to make sure that it's dried off. Another thing you want to do is make sure that you have a fire extinguisher handy, so that if you do have a fire, you can put it out. Now, if the fire gets too big, you want to make sure you just call 911. Don't try to put it out. So if it's a small fire that you can put out with an extinguisher, put the fire out. Another important factor is to make sure your oil level is not too high. Now, we use water for the sample so that you can see what happens if you fill your oil level too high in the pot. So, we're going to have our friend Dimitri demonstrate what happens when you put a turkey in the oil and the oil level is too high. So, what you have to do is before you start cooking, put water in there first and test the water level to make sure that it's going overflow. Then you can mark on the, on the side where the water level should be and then you put your oil in there. You heat your oil. Make sure you have a thermometer because you don't want your oil to get too hot. Because if the oil gets too hot, you can have a fire also. So, come on up, then. And don't try this at home. Another thing, or come on up. Another thing you could do is when you come over, once again, right there, come over, come over there. And as you come down, as you see, this is what happens. If that's hot oil, you'll start a fire. So we don't want you to fill it up too high. Go ahead and put it in here. Imagine if this was burning, this burner was on, the propane was on, and you have hot oil spilling, you're going to have a big fire, and that oil running down will catch on fire, and now you have a big fire. So make sure you measure this ahead of time. So, another thing is that you want to make sure that if you have children or pets, three feet, the same way we did in the kitchen, circle of safety around this hot oil. Three feet. So there you have it. Your safety tips to have a nice, safe Thanksgiving. That fried turkey is going to taste nice. It's going to be nice and juicy. But the key is not to have any fires or no fire mentality this holiday season.